Welcome back everyone, this is CNS Gaming. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. So this is the maple syrup production. I wanted to show it off. So in order to find this, you're going to want to go into the build mode, go to productions, it'll be found under greenhouses, and it's the maple syrup farm. It is 7 slots and 16,000. Beware, whenever you place it, make sure it's on a flat, flat, um, ground area because as you can see whenever I placed mine it wasn't flat and it kind of was like this so I want to make sure it's flat but for our tutorial video that'll be fine for your gameplay I don't know if you would want it to be like this as you can see but I know I've been kind of slipping out of doing tutorial videos and whatnot and map tours but I'm going to get back into doing that again so here it is if you come to this little icon on your menu you see your production chains maple syrup um, cycles a month 684 production cost a month hundred and twenty dollars recipe is two water for one maple so every two waters will be one maple so eight thousand water will get you four thousand maple so in order to get water you need to place down a water tank if you don't know how to do that all you have to do is come into buildings go to containers and at the very end here there's one or if you have a mods added in which I don't on this game save well I have a couple but only two added in but yeah there's other water tanks as well that you can get off of the mod hub so once you got your water all you do is come over here to the water icon which is right here oh I can't drive wouldn't be a CNS gaming video without a crash so for me I'm on PlayStation so it's R1 and triangle to unload so all you want to do is just unload your water into this little icon here and if you come over to the wrench you can left left uh, stick down it'll pull up this as well so as you can see we're getting even more water in there should have 16,000 liters there now in order to do anything you have to hit X to activate so now that it's activated it will start producing some maple syrup and will spawn here now I do have the lift mod so I don't know how heavy the pallets are so if you don't have the pallet lift mod make sure you get that because it's a great mod to have unless you want to play kind of more realistic and I also have this new trailer here that was on the mod hub today as well and it is a auto load trailer it holds 20,000 liters which is pretty cool so we'll get to try that out so let's just have a look around here i haven't really looked around so you know you have the maple trees here with uh i guess maple catchers there that's what catches the maple i don't really know how maple trees work in the real world but pretty cool let's show the flashlight so we can see you even have like a little rock here that's kind of cool so yeah i mean there's one two three four five well that would be six seven eight so there's eight trees i'm not sure how fast it'll be but we'll go ahead and speed up time i mean a wheelbarrow here shovel and whatnot that's pretty cool yeah i mean it's pretty cool um i know that they had orchards and stuff on fs19 but not for console it was only for pc so it's cool to have orchards now so that's pretty cool um it would be cool to give them manure and water that'd be kind of cool to like fertilize them but i'm happy with it let me know what you guys think about this mod in the comments. Now, actually, before we speed up time, let's talk about how to sell these off. So, selling points, you're going to want to go to production selling points. And then here we have a maple syrup sale. So, you can kind of put this wherever you want. For this video, we're not going to put it too far. We're going to put it right here. So, there we go. Just throw it down there. So, Let's come over here and take a look at this. So this is where you're going to sell off your maple. Um, I guess this is what it looks like once the pallet comes out. But we'll see that here in a second. So this is where you'll sell off your maple syrup. Let's take a look at it here in the um, prices. Probably be at the very bottom, I would imagine. Yep, there it is. So, oh, they even have the price. Um functions for you I think that's how you say it so the best price you can get for this is 2600 and that would be in March worst time to sell it would be in September and you'd only get 2100 so only a $500 difference not too bad but yeah so what I'm gonna do 
go ahead and let time speed up get some pallets out and then I'll bring you guys back okay, in okay so we have three pallets it's kind of a slow process to be honest with you guys and the liftable pallet mod does not work as you can see down in the bottom right corner the mass is 319 kilograms you can only pick up 200 kilograms nothing over so the liftable pallet mod is in uh, is installed and it's not allowing me to pick it up as you can see but they're 288,000 liters apiece, so let's go ahead, grab our awesome little trailer here. Probably have to unfold this for it to be auto load, which would be my guess. First time ever using this, so we're going to back up, and as you can see, it's automatically loading it up for us. Oh, well, hit that one. Again, like I said, not a CNS gaming video, unless there's some crashing going on. We'll load this up. We didn't get too much. We only got 864 liters, but this is just a video to show you guys how to use it and whatnot. So, then all you're going to do is come over to this little sub point wherever you decide to place it. And how does this auto load work? Not really sure how this trailer works, but maybe we should turn on the help window. We're going to need help for our tutorial video. Is there any, maybe there's something wrong with the trailer? Okay, that's strange. Um, closed door. That won't really do anything with it. Open door. I wonder why this auto load won't work. That is very strange. Alright, well. There's no like all unload. There we go. Oh my goodness, and it unloaded the hallway over there. Shoot. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm a fan of this trailer. Let's just um, try and push these in over here. Okay, not not a video that I made unless there's some issues going on. There we go. We sold off $619 for a pallet. Not too bad, not too bad at all. And we all will push this last one in, so this really isn't the best way to do it, I wouldn't say, but there are other auto load trailers that'll work better. So again, just a tutorial video, so hopefully this um, helped you guys out if you were having any issues or just wanted to see a new mod or something, I don't know, but yeah, so you're going to need a water tank, you're going to need the production, and you're going to need this thing right here to sell it off. You won't be able to sell off the maple syrup at any other sub point except for this one. So don't forget to place this guy down. But overall, I really like it. I really like um, the orchard. Hopefully we get some like apples and whatnot. So that would be pretty cool to get some of them. And this auto load trailer, to do a review on it, for the maple maple um, farm thing here, I definitely say use it. It's pretty cool. I like it. 10 out of 10 on that. Auto load trailer. It's cool. I like the 20,000 liter capacity, kind of unreal capacity for this. But the only thing I don't like is the unload. But maybe if I knew how to unload it properly, I would like it more. But due to it not functioning very well, and it throwing the pallets out like behind the cell point and I was even kind of pulled up kind of far not a fan but I probably will still use it once I get the hang of it a little bit better so not bad trailer awesome awesome production farm over here really like that so if you enjoyed this video make sure you hit the like button if you haven't yet make sure you subscribe currently we're only eight subscribers away from 700 so if you guys could please hit that subscribe button that would be awesome but anyway guys i'll see you guys in the next video or tonight at 10 p.m eastern time at my live stream so see you guys then thanks for watching